Hey, how's it going, everyone? Welcome back to some more Darkest Dungeon Catacorder Estate. We have a bunch of people in the sanitarium taking care of diseases and quirks. Basically, as many as we can fit. Uh, we don't have anybody else that has a disease, so can't take full advantage of it, but pretty close. I also sold all of my portraits trying to get busts to try and unlock this last one, but there's no way I can get to 60. So, it is what it is. <laughs> it's whatever. We're gonna do an antiquarian run this time. Try and collect some money. This is a pretty decent party as well. Not a healer, unfortunately, but an easy run. A couple of level ones uh, bring out this level zero, as well as Tustain, who's a uh, level two. Lots of damage buffs. He's got the uh, redemption amulet, armlet, and the sun ring for plus thirty percent damage. He's got legendary bracer and wounding helmet for plus forty percent damage. He's got Protective Collar and Legendary Bracer, so he's got plus 15 damage, percent damage, but he's also got 12 more dodge, so he's got a big old boost to dodge. Considering he's level 0, that, that's helpful. And then she's got 80% to healing, so her little Fortifying Vapors heal <clears throat> might actually heal more than 2, which would be sweet. Um, and I don't think she can have it up leveled up, can she? No. Um, he can level his stuff up. And I think we should. We'll, we'll level up the ones that we're using right now for now. Yeah, that's good. All right, and I think we're ready to go. We're just going to do a, yeah, just a fun little run. Um, I'm going to do Torchless as well. Let's make sure we got plenty of food. Um, let's do two of each. Uh, two of those. Three keys. A couple of those. That looks pretty good to me. Um, we might as well get some more food, actually, as well. Use it for healing in case it's needed. Everything else looks fine. Let's grab three of these just in case. Yeah, that looks good. All right, yeah, a little torchless run with the Antiquarian. Decent party. It's only a level one dungeon, so it's a lower end dungeon. It's perfect for this team. Even the fiercest beast will lay down when it is not eaten. Steal their food. All right, this is going to be a pretty decent. This guy already has a decent amount of stress to begin with, as does he because he's level zero. But uh, we should do fine. We have a chance to camp as well at some point. Um, I should pull up my thing in Boober. And I think we're in the Warrens, aren't we? Yeah, we're in the Warrens. Uh, you cleanse us with a torch. And it removes a negative quirk. Really? That's pretty sweet. You have no negative quirks. Good on you. Blutomania, no cheats, not a big deal. Cityomania would be nice to get rid of. It's not, like, absolutely necessary, but it's probably the, one of the better ones. I don't have a torch, though. I'll leave it. I'll leave it in case we need it for later. Wonders can be found in the most tenebrous corners of this place. I'll just keep in mind that if I want to go back to remove Quirk, that's where I'm going to go. There we go. All right, there's our torch. We'll use that on, on the thing, remove, probably, try and remove, remove at least that locked in one, would be nice. Alright. Nervous stab, couldn't get the kill. We'll try. It's music! It's awesome, love it. That's unfortunate, but you already went, so whatever. Yeah, just keep attacking the antiquarian, I don't care. <laughs> She's like the least of my concerns, really. Uh, Hugh would get a kill. He would get two kills. Is that what I want to do right right now? No. I want to just kill one. Or you can miss. Because <laughs> that's what you do. I want to stress heal. Get a little bit of stress relief. I kind of wanted it on him, but that works. Good hit. Alright, he'll probably go before us. Yeah, because she's stunned, so. Yep, there it is. Web is not a big deal. Probably going to stun her again. Ah, oh, good resist. Alright, um, he's got a self-stress heal, so let's take care of that. Let's just use this moment to uh, kind of heal up a little bit. Take care of everybody. Alright, not bad. Um, and you uppercut him. Just because you can, because it's hilarious to kill something with an uppercut. Alright, your blight will go away very soon. And then you'll probably heal yourself, if anybody. All right, let's head back. There's that, and boop. Hunger, that's fine. Got plenty of food. 
I can use a little bit for healing if needed. Which I probably will do. Probably. Alright, let's head back this way. I'm not gonna go to that fight. I'm just gonna backtrack after this. Alright, and it's you, right? Yeah. So you will use a torch on this. There we go. And you got rid of Cityomania, the one that's locked in. Good stuff. All right, we'll back up. Beep, beep. <laughs> After the last salty episode, oh man, I, I was just a salt factory. After that, I uh, feel like now's a good time. You know, let's do a, let's do a little antiquarian run. Let's make some money. A good time. You can eat some food. Yeah, let's do that. Um, <clears throat> just get rid of the torch. I don't want it. Doing torchless. All right. Drums of doom, munch. This isn't a big, big ordeal, though. That's unfortunate. He can't do squat from back there. Drums of debilitation is a debuff. Dodge debuff. All right. So you do four to six damage. Just hit the third one. It's a little harder for everybody else to hit. This is blight. Good dodge. He's not going to be able to dodge. <laughs> yeah, he's got a negative 10 dodge. At least he resisted. Um, you can't do squat from this position, so you move back. I'll put the antiquarian in front, I guess. Yeah, that shuffle's a little unfortunate. But uh, it's okay. We'll get it. We'll work it out. All right, you can get a kill on one of these. Yeah. Another abomination Beautiful. From our lands. That guy needs a super heal. Good God, man. Dodge something. Drums of Doom. It's gonna be a lot of stress. Well, that's not too bad. Alright, you... You can't heal from this position, so... Kill it. You can heal yourself. A little bit of Lick Wounds. And you can collect Bounty on him. There we go. And he can heal. To remove the bodies out of the way. Good dodges. Beautiful dodges. Alright. Um, you can't never step from here. You can might as well just try and do that. Good stuff. Uh, yeah, you hew. No, no, no. Not hew. Purge. There we go. Pull everybody forward. You're going to self-heal again. Hug your doogie. And you're dead. Super dead. Right. Low and driven into the mud. We'll get rid of the jade. This is a heirloom chest. Use a key. And what do we get? Some good stuff. Alright. Um I think I'll get rid of the holy water. Do I want to get rid of the holy water? I feel like holy water is actually useful here. I think this is one of the places where holy water actually has like a big purpose. Um, anti-venom, maybe? Yeah. Yeah, I think I'll get rid of the anti-venom. In place of these deeds and... Actually kind of don't really care about the bandages either. Yeah, let's get rid of the bandages as well. Just take the citrine. If I get something better, I'll put something better there. Alright. Let's uh, make sure we're back in our original positions. You were going to be the one to grab, obviously. Map. Yeah, it's got the whole thing. That'd be awesome. Oh, wow, it did. It's the entirety of it, except for two rooms. Uh, gather three grain sacks. Is what we're doing, huh? So there's Kirio, Kirio, quest location. Quest location there. And probably way over here somewhere. There it is. All right. Under pock, that's fine. A little bit of healing. All right, do I want to go these ways? For these Kirios? Eh, there's a lot on the way around. I don't think I need to bother. I think I'll keep going. I think we'll get plenty of, of gold. And if, if, you know, if not, I can backtrack. I don't need torches, so whatever. Maggots. At least we didn't get shuffled this time. They're probably all going to go first. I hope not. Wow, nice crit. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> a crit. A uh, crit from a freaking... Whatever. Um, four to six damage. Good. I'm so glad you got the six damage. And you're going to hew. Yeah. Be gone, fiend. 
you're stunned, so that's unfortunate. Uh, you're gonna uppercut? Yeah. Stun it. Good stun. Stun chance is so low, but not gonna take a chance to heal. So let's do some a little bit of healing vapors. You're gonna do a little bit of self heal as well. These guys are hitting really hard. <laughs> do they have increased damage? Oh, they do. Yeah. Um, you're gonna do yeah, self heal. Get you back on track. And you're gonna do withstand. A little stress relief on yourself. And uppercut him again. Because <laughs> it's hilarious to kill something with an uppercut. Alright. Good stuff. I hear the squilly piggies. You hear the squilly piggies? Alright, we'll go this way. The quest location. Yeah, why not? Have to anyway, so. Use a shovel. Such blockages are unsurprising. These tunnels predate even the earliest settlers. All right, good stuff. We're going to make some good money from this. As long as everybody can stay alive. All right, I really don't like these. That web is really annoying. Bite is also annoying, but I really hate the web. That said, there's not a whole lot I could really do. I could just... Well, I could miss. But as I was going to say, I, I won't be able to do a whole lot of damage. Please don't stun. Yeah. All right, you're going to hew. Get rid of two of them. As the, fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. the two worst ones, too. The bite and spit suck, especially when they hit really hard like that. And the blight, if he gets it. And he didn't. It's fine. Keep attacking him. He's just going to keep healing himself. God, the hit's like a truck, though. They really do. Um, and you're just going to kill one of them. Holy crap. The enemy crumbles. Good stuff. A little bit of stress relief for everybody. Too bad you went first. At least you can self-heal, though. And you're going to do some healing on him. And you're going to withstand. He's probably going to attack him again because it's low health. Yeah. Good dodge. I was like, you got 22 dodge, man. I even gave you like 10 dodge right here. Or 12 dodge from that. So at some point, you're going to have to dodge. Uppercut it. Stun that son of a bitch. Stun him. All right, some more healing. Beautiful. Get some of that stress relief as well. Self heal. Yes! That's what I like to see. All right, we're looking a lot better now. A lot better than before. As victories mount, so too will resistance. All right, I don't have any way to get rid of that, but it's only one more damage. Uh, I don't have any reason to carry this with me as well. I'm going to need to take this. So, let's just drop the citrine. And head back down. Got a trap on the way. I think he could actually be the best one to do that too, right? He's got a really high chance. 80. Yeah, let's give you it. Good stuff. Good disarm. A little stress relief. Um, And then from here... We have another quest there. So let's head down. A little hunger, no problem. There's another quest. That saved us some space as well. Perfect time for that. Waiting to be spent. Okay, this is a huge damage buff, if I remember correctly. Yes, it is indeed. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it there. I'm gonna probably camp in this room that we're coming up to right now. All right, he's a bleeder for sure. We need to kill that guy. I don't want the stress. He also sucks with a vomit, yeah. I think that's stress and that's a, yeah. That's a high chance for disease, like 30% or something. Stupid high. All right, eventually we'll go. Not yet though. Soon though. All right, um. Never stab on him. Good damage. Um, you can do a chop and probably kill. Ooh, almost. Yeah, you could kill him probably. Good stuff. Good stuff. You're going to finish him on him. I'm not so worried about the swine chopper. You're going to hounds rush the back guy. Yeah. Beautiful crit. Some more stress relief. Ball and chain might be a stun. Stun and knockback probably. Resisted at all. Good stuff. You can't stab the back, but you can Festering Vapor, which will kill. 
All right. What's your cut? No big deal. A little bit of bleed. Yeah, a little bit of bleed. Um, let's do some healing. That's fine. You need to withstand. Be a little self-stress heal. Your stress is basically nil at this point. You're going to uppercut him in the face. <laughs> Knock him back, too. Yeah, I like them apples. All right, and you're going to do a self-heal. Yes! That crit. That clutch crit. All right. Now, you're going to purge all the bodies so he can't hide from us anymore. And you're going to target Whistle. Screw his protection and all that. He doesn't even have any protection, I don't think, but Click Bounty works here. Almost killed him. You had a really high chance to kill him. But you can. Good stuff. A trifling victory. But a victory nonetheless. Alright. And this is... Uh, this is a way of removing a quirk or something, isn't it? I think it's in everything. Yeah, nor only water. Yeah, you purge a negative trait. I like that. Who has a negative trait that needs purged? Glutomania, known cheat, winded. Winded's kind of stupid. And oh, gambler sucks too. I don't like. I don't like using gambler. And it's holy water. Holy water. I think. <laughs> All right. I kind of wish you had gotten rid of gamble because I don't like. I don't like using the uh, the place for the gambling. All right, let's go this way. And then there's this. This is holy water. I don't know what it gives. Um. Well, uh, I guess if it does something positive, I guess I'll give it to this guy. It's probably just stuff, maybe. Oh, you know what? I should have done that with her then. Oops, I forgot that dodge was there. All right, let's back up. <clears throat> I don't need to go to that room. Um, let's go this way. Good stuff. Some more food as well. I like that. Eat that. You dodged, didn't you? Yeah, good stuff. All right, is there a fight in here? Possibly. I don't know. We didn't actually see this room. Yes, there is. All right, this wretch needs to die. Um, That's not the worst. That is not the worst. Just do a lot of damage to this guy. He needs to die. If you gotta keep giving her diseases, that's fine. It's fine. You're gonna give her stress though. That also kind of sucks a lot, but um, you need to move forward. So let's move you forward one. That way he can still attack. You picked a good target for that. He's got, doesn't have very much stress heal to begin with. You can only target Whistle from the front, huh? All right. I'll target Whistle him. Mark him, give him a little, like, loss and everything, basically. Uh, six to 13. Not great. I like killing him outright. Oh, come on. That was minimum, minimum. That's your own damn fault, man. That is your own damn fault. Your freaking minimum damage. Good crit. Beautiful crit. Yeah. That's fine. You can knock my antiquarian out with a ball and chain. I don't care. Don't give him a don't give him a disease. Of course. Of course. Is it my turn now? No? Alright. Just let all of them go first. Someday. There we go. Just Hugh. Alright. You need to move back. Move back here. You're gonna collect bounty. No, you're gonna you're gonna finish him on this guy. Get rid of him. Decimated. For giving you the night blindness or hysterical blindness or whatever. That's fine. It's no big deal. That sucks. Good dodge. Good dodge. All right. Heal's not a terrible idea. Beautiful crit. Little stress relief as well. You need that stress relief, so chop him. Good kill. All right, we need to kill this fool back here. Um, damn it. There's no way to get her. 9 to 17. Just 
get rid of a body, I guess. Move her forward a little bit. Grab a stab. And then hopefully... Nope. She gets to go first. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, pull him forward. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Uh, Hound's Rush. God, I need to get rid of some stress, though. Let's do this. I'm going to uppercut her, I think. Oh, he didn't let me go first. That's stupid. That's annoying. All right, fine. Fine. We'll go another round of this stuff then. Um, Because I can't... Yeah, I can't do anything but about it. But he needs some stress healing. She's probably going to target him. Oh, no. Okay, good. Target somebody else. I don't care. Uh, some more heals. Good heal. All right. I think now's a good time. Yeah, just kill her. <laughs> good stuff. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. I really don't want to get rid of much here. I wouldn't mind having another stack of gold, though. Yeah, let's get rid of the medicinal herbs. The gold. Um, I don't know what this thing is. Cannot be cleansed. It's a buff. It's another buff. Okay, let's uh, let's camp in this room. Get rid of the firewood. A spark without kindling. Hmm. A goal without hope. Honestly, I kind of just want to do this. For the sake of food procs. This will allow us to have two food procs and probably heal us up all the way. Yeah, let's do that. Alright, we need stress relief. Therapy dog. Yeah. Um... Hmm. Looks like we're just going to be stuck encouraging people at this point. Man's best friend's pretty good. Hound's watch is pretty good. That'll work. And she can grab a trinket. An item. Well, uh, whatever. <laughs> I kind of hoped you'd grab something, anything else, really. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. Nah. -uh. You ain't got a lot to kick it. Oh, wait. Who do I want to give the buff to? I think the bounty hunter. Oh, no, sir. Yeah, damage buff. Accuracy buff, all good stuff. All right, you go, grab this, take all of that, let's get rid of that, take that. There we go. Oh, I saw the trap, but it was too late. Watch your step. Indeed. All right, we're looking pretty good so far. I think there's a quest item. Yeah, there's the quest item. Um... All right, just grab it. What do I want to get rid of? Could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. I'm just gonna get rid of the dog treats. Let's continue. I'm not done yet. All right, we got another trap here. 80%. Yeah, go for it. God, man, even when I try, you can't do it. You Ooh, suck, dude. To life. You suck a lot. With a singular purpose. This is bandages, I think. Right? Yeah. 40% chance of loot, 40% chance of bleed. You can handle the bleed. Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. Ah, whatever. No matter. There's nothing in here, so I don't care. <laughs> Turn around. Do we have shovels still? We do. There's another trap, huh? Okay. Ambushed by foul invention. Whatever. That trap must have just showed up afterwards and I just walked forward too fast. Let's go this way. We get through this obstacle. Like so. 
And what do we got here? One of these scrawling things. What is this? This curio will give you a hunt will 100% give you a debuff, negative 20 dodge if you cleanse it. So you don't want to cleanse it. It has a chance of a positive quirk, chance of a negative quirk, chance of a really high stress. Um I think we'll just try it with you. Just try it. Look at it, read it. Alright, you got a negative quirk. Screw you then. Dysphomania. Cravings for alcohol, whatever. It's not that bad. Not that bad. Blood this way. There was this other thing over here, wasn't there? Yeah, this. I think I use herbs on this. Oh, come on, dude. All of a sudden... Oh, I just got that stupid quirk that made him do that. You're a moron. <laughs> You're such a dumbass. Whatever. Go this way. I'm just gonna head down to this curio and then call it quits. How are we doing money here? We have 2,700 there. We didn't get too many of the rare antiques, unfortunately. This is only a level 1 dungeon. I think that matters. Alright. What do we got? Not bad. That's pretty good stuff. Alright, let's get out of here. Our supplies are replenished. The soldiers will feast tonight. Considering I had to bring out three grain sacks, you know along with my treasure. That was a pretty good run, all things considered. Yeah, 15,000. Didn't find any secret rooms or anything like that, so... Not bad. Got a little bit of experience. A couple level twos now. Faithless. That sucks. Plutomania is annoying too. Tough is fantastic, though. That's a good one. A modest offering. From those few surrounding farms as yet untouched by the spreading calamity. Alright, and we also got 100% uh, Butchman Digit. So that means that the next run I can just take as much as I want. And it's free. So, whatever. Alright, you didn't get rid of the worries? Fine, I'll get rid of it for you. It's okay. Alright, then you need to go in here. Yeah. Who else? Sorry, let's go by stress level. Alright, Druel needs to go. Some stress relief. Tustain probably could do with some as well. There we go. Alright, what are we looking at now? Got a couple of different boss fights. Got, uh, activate three infected corpses. Alright. I got two protective collars. I definitely don't need another one. Go back to the cove for a simpler, more simpler run. See if we can't get rid of some of the bad quirks on some of these people. Probably not a terrible idea. Fear Mankind sucks. That's probably what we'll do. Probably go back to the cove, the shorter run. I think that's a good idea. But that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. I've been Chaotic Order, and I will see you next time.